I am going to start this video with three numbers. 42,700, 2,200, and 114. The first number was the tonnage of the Bismarck. It was the world's largest and most advanced battleship when launched. However, even before its first engagement on May 21st of 1941, it was being rendered obsolete by the advent of the carrier group. The second number, 2200, that is the number of men that were assigned to the Bismarck. 114, that's the number of men that survived the sinking of the Bismarck. Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening. I am Harbinger the Pentagenarian, and today I am going to be watching and listening to the Sabaton song, Bismarck. This is a battleship that was infamous. It had books and movies made about the goal of Sink the Bismarck. When it was launched, it was the world's largest target and the world's most expensive target. It ran one mission, officially, and between the launch for that mission, which was May 21st, there were six days before it was crippled and then sunk, with nearly all hands lost. So, I am going to stop yammering, and we are going to watch Sabaton Bismarck. All right, let's dive into this. So, did you find the boat? Oh, I wonder if we're going to see some of the, uh, the drone footage.
by iron and blood. The flagship of the navy, the terror of the seas, his guns have gone silent at last. That was very good. I am going to make a comment on that now. That may well be my favorite so far from Sabaton. It was well done. It was executed very well. The song itself was great. The chorus of it was fantastic. The cinematics, as with all of their videos, were absolutely superb. And it told the story of the Bismarck, and it did it well. It didn't need to get into a lot of detail. Um, I would like to see, and I will watch the the making of that video, and I, I know that on their Sabaton History channel, so to speak, they have the making of videos and the history behind things, so I will be watching that. Um, what I am interested in knowing, and I'm sure I'll see it, but if you know before I see it, leave in the comments if the individual that was playing the captain that took them out to the area that the Bismarck was sunk, um, it, it may not have been, but they did a very good job in posing the question, was that the young man that actually recovered the captain's watch? It would be interesting to know. Um, I really like that part of it as well, as far as, you know, he is a survivor and, you know, who better to take you to the area that your ship was lost at. It was very, um, it, it was just a really good video and a very good song. And that's one of the things I appreciate about Sabaton is I am a history nut. I always have been since my very first book that showed the ancient ruins of Angkor Wat. Uh, history has just something that has been ingrained in me. And World War II is big, World War I. Um, any of those type of conflicts are always uh, of interest to me. Not so much because of the aspect of war, but more along the lines of, when are we going to learn? When are we going to get to a point where we understand that lines in the sand are not worth thousands or millions of lives. And it all boils down to ideology. And 
it's really kind of sad because the average person is more concerned with putting food on their table, and it is governments and individuals within governments that fight wars. It is the leadership of countries that cause wars. So I think that's one of the things I appreciate about Sabaton is they're raising the awareness of events that happened in military history because they're important. And they're important from the aspect that when they perform a song, it isn't just about the battle. It's about the men in the battle. It's about the individuals. So that is one of the things I truly appreciate about the way they film the videos that they produce. I am going to stop there. But um, overall performance, absolutely phenomenal. Uh, the music was good. It was very fitting as well to the events that happened. Um, you definitely felt the pride of the of the sailors on the Bismarck, and they were also able to move that to the need and desperation of the Allied forces to sink this monster. So again, great performance, fantastic video. Well done. I applaud you. Two thumbs up. And um, I will be watching more of the Sabaton videos because I really like the band and I like what they do. So until next time, take care of yourselves. Be good to one another. Don't be a dick because the world already has enough of them. You all take care. Bye-bye.